Despite all the progress made in downtown Mobile over the years, the old Gaffer's building on Bienville Square remains an eyesore. There have been many plans to renovate the building over the last three decades, but nothing has ever come of them. Now, Mayor Sandy Stimson wants to use $8 million of American Rescue Plan funding for this project. News 5's Gabby Easterwood has reaction. A revamp to a long abandoned building in the heart of downtown Mobile is back on the table. It's just a very exciting project for the downtown area. There is backlash too. Some think the proposed $8 million should be used elsewhere. And this location would not benefit those who need it the most. The Gapers building, which sits just off Beneville Square, is the space in question. The proposed plan would create 95 workforce units with an income cap. The bottom level set aside for commercial use. Multiple residents addressed council today, saying other areas are in dire need of affordable housing. Poor people who need the affordable housing do not live in downtown Mobile. So why do you want to put $8 million into a building where the people who need it don't reside there? The mayor says that wasn't an option, though. There is no other shovel-ready project for affordable housing in the city. You have to have a developer that's willing to spend the money in those areas, you know, to build a project. And if you don't have a developer that wants to do that, you don't have a project. That nonprofit developer, Gulf Coast Housing Partnership, is willing to put up another $16 million to complete the renovation. The goal, though, is simple, to make it affordable for people who work downtown to also live there. The people that are working in our bars and restaurants uh, and some of the downtown businesses, you know, just like everybody else, you know, they have to have transportation cost. And uh, if you can live in the area where you're going to work, you know, it certainly saves you money. And all of these units are uh, controlled by some formula of affordable housing. In Mobile, Gabby Easterwood, WKRG News 5. And the City Council will take this issue up again at its meeting in two weeks.